let's do this. Hello everyone, I am Blakestar and welcome to my new K-pop channel. So, a little bit of an introduction about myself. I first got into K-pop uh, around 2011. I first discovered it in around 2010, the end of 2010. And the main reason why I really wanted to become a K-pop YouTuber or just, you know, a YouTuber that happens to have a K-pop channel as I also have a main channel called Blakester TV. This channel is A.O. Blakester, so if you haven't checked that out, which there will probably be no videos at this particular point in time, but make sure and check it out whenever I do post a video, which should be pretty soon. But the main reason why I wanted to become a K-pop YouTuber is because it just seems like the K-pop family just thrives online, and the only thing I've really been able to do online thus far is just watch videos, watch reaction videos, watch people on Twitter. I mean, there are just so many K-pop YouTubers on the internet right now, and so many of these YouTubers are like really good friends with one another, and from what I see in the videos that they do and the stuff that they do on Twitter, I'm just like, I want to be a part of that. Like, I really, really wanted to be a part of this for quite a while now. And what really influenced me to start YouTube was because I actually did a video um, of a vacation that I did um, a little while ago, like actually a year ago. And from that video, um, a lot of people told me, yo, you should start YouTube. You're really good at this. And I was just like, Okay! Like, I never ever thought that I would ever start YouTube, to be perfectly honest. Like, I never thought I'd get into this. But what also really motivated me to start YouTube is the field that I really want to go in, which is the entertainment business, you know, mainly cartoons and animation. And also, you know, short subjects like commercials, music videos, um, short films and whatnot. And so this is sort of my first foray into basically the public eye, like getting myself known out there. And I really, really hope that you guys like what I do. And if it's not good from the first string of videos that I'm going to be doing here on this channel and my other main channel, I will get better. But right now we're going to start off a series of reaction videos I've been really wanting to react to recently. And this reaction video is going to be BTS's Blood, Sweat, and Tears. I don't even know if I even did that correctly. And I know what you guys are probably thinking. Hey yo, Nubu, this video's like a month old. Yes, I know this video is like a month old. However, as you can see, I'm living in the apartment because I'm actually in school right now. And this particular time in the semester has been very busy, like this past month, that I haven't been able to really start my channel until now. And I've actually been putting off reacting to all these videos that I know people have been anticipating for a long time, including myself and BTS is one of them. I may have heard a few snippets of it on like random things like, you know, Korean intelligent programs. And I might have seen like a few memes, probably several memes at this point of images from the music video, but I have not seen the music video at all. I have not heard the song at all. And let me tell you some BTS. <laughs> Kudos to you, BTS. I mean, this is just such an amazing underdog story. They are from nowhere close to a big three company, yet with this comeback especially, they've been breaking records left and right. I mean, highest charting K-pop album on the Billboard 200, highest amount of views for a K-pop boy group in 24 hours, fastest K-pop boy group to reach 10, 20, 30 million views. First K-pop group to have their own emoji on Twitter. First K-pop group to reach number one on the Billboard Social 50 chart. 
and I'm sure countless others. So with those records in mind, I am pretty sure that this song is really, really good. I do really enjoy a lot of BTS's songs like Bulletproof, Boy in Love, and um, of course their classic hit Dope. And I really love Fire, like that is a jam right there. So I have pretty high expectations for this video because, you know, BTS are pretty much at the very top of their game right now. Like, this is their peak that they're in right now. So, let's get into this video, shall we? Duh! Alright, so this is my setup right now. As you can see, I have my laptop over here off screen. And I have my monitor over here and the main reason why I'm doing this is because I don't have editing software that lets me do picture-in-picture picture yet so this is going to be my sort of makeshift thing right now where I'm going to be watching for my laptop but you're going to see it through here but you're going to be seeing what I'm seeing basically so without further ado BTS blood sweat and tears and just to let you guys know, I do know all the members' names, but I can't really put a name to a face that well. The only ones that I do know from the face, basically, are Rap Monster and J-Hope. So, um, please don't hate me, armies. I'm just, I'm, I'm not a true, like, Oh my goodness, BTS! fan. I'm just, I'm just your standard K-popper that likes a lot of different songs. I, that's what I love about it. Like, I love K-pop for what it is. It's good music, the videos are great and high budget quality, and I do love a lot of groups. But I mostly like a lot of groups for, you know, their songs. Like, a lot of the groups, I don't really follow that them that much on, like, varieties, which I heard BTS are really good at varieties. So let's go in 3, 2, 1, hit the playback. Ooh. Shout out if you know where that's from. Big Hit Entertainment. Let's see what you got. This video is six minutes long, too, so. Oh, there they are. You should run a bicycle. Okay. Oh. Ratmon. What, what was he holding? Oh, it's a little guy. Okay. You know, he's studying. That's why he's top 1% in the South Korea. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be an artsy video. I heard it's gonna be an artsy video. This is a very mature concept for them too, I heard as well. Oh, what's on Trini? Let's... I do appreciate art as well. I wonder what he finds intriguing about that. It's like a whole battle. <laughs> oh, just sitting there staring. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. I just realized I didn't have the subtitles on, I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. What I can do with this? I can dig this. Nah, I'm not I'm not gonna try. I'm I'm new. I'm just a rookie. Ratmon. What's good? <laughs> I guess that's supposed to be symbolizing something, all those colors. Oh, I love the artsy feel in this video. Okay, what's going on? Oh! <laughs> I wouldn't lick that off my finger though. <laughs> okay, grabbing them here and there. What? That might be poison! Oh! Nice! Oh, I love the artsiness in it. Oh, <laughs> How many times are they gonna have their. that area? <laughs> Of post to success. <laughs> oh, they just hit 
They just called it Unicorn or something. Oh, smoke? Who not the smoke bomb? They're not fun to breathe, I, I know that. Okay. Oh, whoa! How high was that? The ceiling, not him. Oh, oh! Artsy! You know what that, those little filters reminded me of? Daisies. The film. I'm a film major, by the way. And pop culture. Oh! Oh, all those hands covering all you up. Oh! Oh! What's happening? Oh, that looks like some sort of moving movie poster. Oh! Okay. Wow. It just got so serious there. It's getting serious. Oh. Is a giant ball rolling toward you to grab something like Indiana Jones style? Oh. <laughs> Wait, are they looking at him? Oh. What's, what's going down? Oh, close your eyes. <laughs> close your eyes. It's a naked woman. You're too young. Oh, it's a guy. Okay. Well, it's still like... Is it? Oh, now... What's going on? <laughs> okay. I have a feeling a jump scare is going to happen. I, I don't know. Well, you're gonna kiss it? He desperate. Oh, he... Was he, like, whipped? Oh. Artsy. Oh. Apparently that statue was desperate, too. <laughs> oh. Whoa. There must be a lot of symbolism that I'm not getting right now, but was that it? Oh, he's about to crack? Whoa. <laughs> All right, well, that there was BTS's Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Um, what can I say? It's, it's art. Y'all can say whatever it is, like it's commercial music, pop music, and you know, it's a music video, commercial, why not? This is art. And I know, I'm a pop culture major. Yeah, for those of you that don't know, I, I did make myself clear, I'm actually a film and pop culture double major. So yeah, this was a music video, basically a little film. Their pop culture and it's art. That was a very, very interesting video. Like there's definitely a lot of symbolism that I might not get. Now I kind of wish that I listened to that with English subs because I'm sure it would have made a lot more sense or maybe. I don't know. <laughs> the dancing, as usual for BTS, was on point. And they're just one of the best, you know, dancers, really, in terms of, like, boy groups that have, like, good dancing abilities, like BTS, EXO, Infinite, Shiny, you know, those types that are really, really known for dancing. And the song? Um, now something I've really listened to over and over again, like, Dope or Fire or... You know, even Boy in Love or something like that, that is 
those are some really dope songs right there, but I get the feeling, I get the feeling that this song is having, you know, it's supposed to be like a more artful type of film, and yo, shout out to BTS because, you know, they put meaning into their songs, like, not only do they write, produce, and like compose their own stuff, they make it mean something. They make their albums and their songs and their music videos mean something. There's a lot more deeper meaning to this, like, these guys, and of course, Bang PD, or Bang PD, however these people call them, are true, like, geniuses in their form, and I really appreciate it for that. This is something that I really want to do, too, for whatever I want to do in the future, and I I'm gonna have to really start paying attention to BTS now that I think about it. All right, well, that is my reaction to BTS's Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Um, Sorry this reaction isn't really the best, but, and I look really uncomfortable right now, I actually kind of am. <laughs> um, yeah, there isn't a chair here. But I will definitely try and make this work. But yeah, that is my first ever K-pop reaction on YouTube. So yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this really late reaction. And yeah. Definitely more reactions to come. I'm going to react to at least like three more videos after this. So, yeah. This is Blakester. You're watching AO Blakester. And till next time, peace out, Blake Scouts.